Hi, I'm Eric Huggins coming at you from Bakersfield Elite MMA. Here interviewing one of our hometown fighters, JC the Strong Soldier Giannis, in one of the biggest events of this year, 2012, Fight for Life. It's a charity event for cancer awareness. A concert from country group Little Big Town, WBC World Championship Boxing, match for the title, and MMA fights featuring JC who looks to capture another big win here at home. So JC, tell us a little bit about yourself, please. Uh, my name is Juan Carlos Llamas from Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. Uh, I'm San Vicente Nayarit. I'm a professional fighter, a music producer, and a hip hop artist. I live in Bakersfield for the last six years. So, JC, so why Fight for Life? Um, Fight for Life, besides the love of MMA and competition, I think Fight for Life is a scary feeling that many of us or many of our family members has felt before. And I'm doing this particular show to do something, raise money, to find a cure for this horrible disease. So, who are you fighting and you know, and what do you know about him? I'm fighting a guy named Jose Suavecito Diaz. He's 6-0 and as an amateur. He's doing his professional debut against me. He's from Visalia. He trains at Elite MMA and a good fighter. So he's he's six and zero as an amateur. Do you feel like you have an advantage because this is his first pro debut? Um, I don't see any advantage. I think he's a really well-rounded fighter. Uh, a lot of the um, amateurs fights right now they're coming a lot stronger than a lot of professional fights, and I think he's a really well-rounded fight, fighter, w really good wrestler, really good jiu-jitsu guy. So I don't underestimate any of my opponents, regardless who they are. So where do you train and what's your fighting style going into the fight? I train in different locations. I train with Tommy Lito at South Valley Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I train uh, with Dan Camarillo and Brandos Armor uh, Muta Academy and David Woods uh, Fighting Dragons. So, and also I also train in Las Vegas, Nevada. I string couture with a professional fighting team. So how's your weight cut been going and have you had sustained any injury, injuries while training? Uh, my weight cut looks like it's really good. I don't see any problem making weight. And injuries, of course, uh, I think you're always going to have injuries. You're going to be a really lucky fighter if you don't have any injuries going to a fight. But uh, up in the cage, uh, your adrenaline doesn't allow you to feel anything. So what do you think your opponent's game plan is going into the fight? Um, I see one of his fights. That was the only fight I, could, I was able to find in YouTube, and um, he threw a couple of strikes, took the guy down, went for a single leg, took it down, ran a pound, and the referee stopped it really quick. So I think he's going to try to do the same thing. He's going to try to take me down, grab and pound me, and try to stay on top of me. Uh, I'm going to try to, I'm going to reverse every takedown that he does to me and take him down and grab and pound, and uh, I'm going to try to stick to my game plan for sure. Is there anything else that you'd like to add? Uh, well, thank you guys for the interview, and also I want to do a shout out to all my sponsors that helped me to this fight. Um, for example, we have uh, Armors, Kickboxing, Muay Academy, Fight Night Training for the shirts, also Publicity at Cervantes for the shirt, Back in Sport Massage, thank you for the massage. Also Circulo Asesino, one of the biggest hip hop labels in Mexico. Uh, David Woods and Dan Camarillo for training me and let me train in their facility. Also, Archer Exploration Inc. Fight for Life. Hope is here. Thank you. They're, they're doing the event, so they sponsor me too. Thank you so much for the sponsorship. Also, South Valley Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, Tommy Little for training me and letting me train at this facility. Also, La Familia Records for helping me with the training and all the productions for the videos. If you guys need a help to get fixed your truck or fix pimped out, go to Crazy Custom, they hook you up. If you need your car to get fixed, engines, anything, Corona Automotive, that's the best place in town. If you need rims and tires, Guterres and tires, that's a really good place. Uh, Dixie Orthopedic Massage Therapy, she always helped me out when I get injured. She always, I was with her and she fixed me up, so that's a good place to go. And also Bob O'Keefe and Kevin O'Keefe family, they have a member with cancer that passed away. Um, rest in peace and this show is in honor to you guys.
Thank you so much. Uh, I'm so sorry. Uh, I know you got to get some training going. But uh, where's the location of this event? Uh, it's 3200 Back Owens Boulevard. It's going to be Saturday, November 10th in Bakersfield, California. Also, you can find the tickets in Five for Life event or. And also, uh, you said you do music. Is there anywhere we can find your, your music? Oh, yes. Um, you can follow me on my YouTube account. Um, YouTube.com slash Poeta Invalido or just type JC Jamas MMA also in Facebook Facebook.com slash JC1 El Poeta and you can find me there my music, my fights, everything Alright, thanks a lot for the interview, appreciate it Alright, thank you guys